Hey everybody, we're working on the Troy built Tuffy Tiller today. Um, we have a couple things we need to swap out. One is the clutch cable, it's not engaging. And then it's another, then the other thing we want to get to is the shaft seal for the tiller part. Uh, this one's leaking. Uh, my dad was nice enough to pick up the parts. Uh, so we're gonna get it fixed for them. So it's nothing uh, too complicated, so let's just follow along and uh, hopefully this helps somebody out there with the same problems uh, we have here at Sparkle Farm. Okay, with the clutch cable, um, it was actually pretty cost effective to actually get the genuine uh, cable from Troy Belt. Seems like it's Troy Belt, Club Cadet, Remington, MTD. Um, so the cable itself is super simple. So just this end and then this end here hooks to where it engages. So this shouldn't be too bad at all. Alright, now, so what the problem is, uh, the cable itself is frozen inside of the, of the sleeve jacket, so it's not engaging. So, you know, you can pull the clutch all the way back, and all it's doing is just uh, moving your upper spring. So let's take that off, and these are a couple parts you have to reuse. So it's just a flat screwdriver inside. And the hardest part is just lining it up because you gotta do it blind. You just unscrew it. You know, so I can just and do it now. All right, so this, so this is the old stuff, but you have to reuse the screw and the spring. So let's put this together. So I'm just gonna kinda use the marks on it where can tell uh Ooh. we got all the way to the corrosion. I need to put screw it in another half an inch. Okay. Let's just hang that up there. And see, you'll see it's the same one. But let's now move to this step here. So down here, you have your cover, and right at the end of the cable, there's a, like a clip. You just take your screwdriver, and you can pop it off, and you reuse the clip, so don't lose it. And that comes off, and then the next stage here, so that's a 7 16 bolt, so Depending if you have a Tuffy or the horse, I don't know all the names of them. But so you just take it out through the hole in the cover, and that's that's it for that. So let's start by putting it through the cover so we don't forget to do that. back on 
the clip. Too bad that's just a spare channel ox. Now you tighten this back onto here with your 7 16 wrench. Cover back in place. And loop this back up and around. And you just and I can just loop this up right up and around feed the cable through and then snap it right in and then this just hooks it right back up there and guess what we are engaging but let me take the cover off and show you I think I might have to just tighten this up a little more in the spring up here, but uh, that's it. Hey everybody, it's uh, the second half of putting the new bearing seal, seal on the Troy Belt Tuffy. Uh, we just finished changing the, the left side, we're going to change the right side. So this is the old one and then we have the new one so it's not too bad uh, I'll try and talk you through it all right in here is a bolt going through the tines holding them in place so I'm just gonna break that free this is the easy part comes out, the nut comes out, then you take the bolt out. So not too bad. All right, so right here's the seal. There's no best way to take this off. So what we so what we did on the other side is just take the hammer and a screwdriver, and you just keep working through it. Okay, and have a bunch of screwdrivers on hand because the tip on this one bent. Yeah, put the screws in. And this 
kind of rough on your watch, is it? Okay, so yours will probably look just as ugly as this, if not worse, and it's not easy to do, but it comes out. Let's clean it out. Feel pretty good. What's it? Feel pretty good. Yeah, okay. Oh. Okay. that other one? Is it? Mm -hmm. Grease it? Yep. So I got it close, and it started. I'm just using a socket. So, so I can push it in even. Okay, let's put it back together. Add some fluid and we're done. Wipe out the hole here, maybe. Is it good? Okay. All right, so that's how we change the seals on our Troy built filler. And good luck to everyone else that's doing it.